Hi, I'm Greg. And I'm Anne. And we're planning a tiki night. So join us Saturday, May 16th from 5 p.m. to 10 p.m. Pacific Standard Time for the post-quarantine virtual tiki night. And if you are in a different time zone in the UK or anywhere else, then just go ahead and do it that Saturday, May 16th, and save the pictures and send them to the group page uh, on Facebook. We're just happy to share it all and share everybody's experience of that tiki night. Uh, we want to invite you to this and uh, hopefully you'll be able to share pictures and videos, share playlist ideas that you have, and other ideas and recipes that you might have. So watch the Tiki Night intro, it's this video here, which introduces the virtual Tiki Night um, and the plans we have so far. And then you can watch, uh, go over to my new YouTube channel and watch the introduction there. And then we're gonna go through um, making simple syrups there and we're gonna make five or six different tiki cocktails um, the name of my youtube channel is the home bartender with ann gobelt that's me um, and you're gonna view um, post quarantine videos because some of us are, are going back to work but this is a tiki cocktail series just to remind you and uh Greg's going to talk about the group page it's the post quarantine virtual tiki night and um, uh, join up, learn, and share tiki cocktail recipes, food and cooking ideas, uh, sharing tiki night playlists. And uh, we'll also be live on that night. And, uh, but we want you to join and share things. And you know, if you're not there for the live thing, it's fine. The idea is just that Saturday, take pictures of what's going on and post them the next day. You know, that's fine. And Ann's uh, channel, The Home Bartender with Ann Gobelt, we're gonna tell you more about those videos. And it's on Facebook and Instagram under that same uh, name. So go ahead and take a look for that. So let's talk a little bit about the Tiki Drink series, which is just a series within The Home Bartending where Ann's gonna teach you how to make these authentic cocktails. I really enjoy home bartending and I wanted to bring a little Tiki cocktail series uh, to everybody. I also make classic cocktails and uh, I just wanted to to give this gift uh, from my bar to, to your home bar. Um, you can find our videos on Facebook and YouTube and the uh, and Instagram the, and Instagram mm -hmm. at the home bartender with Ann Gobelt. This series is going to include the basic idea uh, of the whole series. It will include the syrups that you need in order to make these tiki drinks. Uh, and then it'll include the cocktail recipes. We're gonna start with a painkiller pain and uh, do five more tiki cocktails. Uh, we have a little shopping list. You're gonna need some sugar for the simple syrups, just granulated sugar. You're gonna need demerara sugar for the demerara syrup. You're going to need uh, one can of coconut cream. I use Thai Kitchen because it just seems to be the best flavored. It's sweet and uh, it doesn't taste like a can. And then you're gonna need some fresh pineapple juice, but I actually use Trader Joe's pineapple juice because it doesn't taste like a can either. And, um, and we're not uh, sponsored by Trader Joe's or anything like that. It just seems to be the best. One fresh pineapple uh, for garnish, just for, for the um, green tops and then for the fruit wedges themselves. Um, you will need eight to 10 limes. You will need Angostura bitters, which you can get at most grocery stores actually. You can also get those Angostura bitters at the liquor store, of course. Um, you're gonna need orange juice. I always try and go with fresh when I can, but if you have to get it from a carton, it's fine. You're gonna need uh, crushed ice which I have a little canvas bag and a hammer that looks like Thor's hammer and I beat the heck out of the canvas bag with the ice in it. Um, but you can always put it in, you can always put ice in a Ziploc bag, throw a towel over the top of it and bang the heck out of it with a hammer or whatever you have. Yeah, me um, tenderizing hammer works really good on the flat side or you could actually use like a, a dough roller that would work really well. For one of the drinks, you will need uh, a whole egg and I will go over that in the videos, but you should buy, you know, a carton so that you can, you can, if you have lots of people there, which you shouldn't because you should be social distancing, right. <laughs> but, uh, you might need three to six three, or something like that. Because you might want to try this one a couple times. Uh, you will need ginger beer. Um, I actually use Fever Tree ginger beer because I think it's the best. 
you can get whatever brand you want. And that's just for the Suffering Bastard, which is one of the drinks. You are going to need basically two different types of rum. I really like Appleton Estates. They have a wide variety of different types of rum, uh, Jamaican rums. And so you're gonna need uh, some Jamaican rum. You're gonna need a light rum. You're going to need, I usually use Smith & Cross, which is 100 proof, but if you don't wanna use that, you can use Pusser's rum. Uh, any rum, favorite rum of your choice really will do. Most of these drinks take two uh, different kinds of rum. The, the Suffering Bastard takes gin, and I oftentimes use Plymouth gin for that. Uh, it also takes bourbon, which is, uh, it's only for one drink that we're using the bourbon. So you could get a small bottle if you wanted to. I prefer Buffalo Trace, actually. Um, and then you're gonna need Campari for the Jungle Bird. You could use Aperol. These are both digestifs, but the um, Campari is a, is a little different flavor than the Aperol, but you, if, use what you have. And then of course the Angostura bitters, uh, you'll need that. So Greg's going to go over some dinner ideas that he's going to be working on and um, take it away. Again, the idea is if you, if you, you can't leave your house, you got to follow your state rules right now. Uh, but practice social distancing. And um, if you can't leave, uh, just anything. If you have a hamburger, have some hamburger and crack open a can of pineapple. The idea is just to be festive about it, even if it's just a beer. So you can make it as difficult or as simple or as adventurous as you'd like. I'm making teriyaki chicken from scratch. Uh, I'm also going to be using a bag of these Korean spare ribs that I really like at Trader Joe's. Uh, and uh, I'm going to be having sticky rice, uh, fresh pineapple and a salad. But uh, some other ideas is just teriyaki beef, either cut up or grilled steaks, teriyaki chicken, shrimp or tofu, macaroni salad with your choice of ingredients. Uh, spare ribs, like I said, I get it Trader Joe's and already done. Uh, meat, seafood skewers, seafood dish grilled or baked, uh, and uh, barbecued vegetables and fruit. Look up some recipes, share recipes. This whole thing is about sharing. We also want you to share playlists, any tiki ideas or albums that you have. Exotica, tiki there we, music. There we go. And also, if you want to play something live or play something and record it, uh, you could use uh, ukulele, drums, just your voice, bagpipes, piano, uh, guitar. It's not about being authentic. It's about having fun and sharing. And uh, that would be great if somebody uh, would share all those different ideas and playlists and play some music. So, so again, please join us at the post-quarantine virtual Tiki Night 2020 on Saturday, May 16th from 5 p.m. to 10 p.m. Pacific Standard Time or just any time on Saturday, do it and go ahead and share all your information on the Facebook group page. And don't forget to get the Tiki Cocktail Series from the home bartender with Ann Gobelt. There's links to her page on YouTube and Facebook and also Instagram. And there you're gonna find not only how to make tiki drinks, but how to make three of the syrups that you're going to need for those authentic tiki cocktails. Please share this with your friends and um, share the channel. And uh, thank you and happy planning. We will see you next week. Have a great week. Take care, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.